For quick and easy garlic bread, I usually, there's two different ways to do it. One is you can slice it this way into just like a normal loaf of bread. But this way is quicker and easier, so I like to just cut it in half. It's kind of, kind of very similar to like French bread pizza. Cut it in half, flip it over, and then I'm gonna get my butter sauce ready. So I have uh, one cube of butter that I have just melted for 30 seconds, and it's giving me this kind of texture consistency, which is what we want, because we don't want it to completely melted, because we wanna kinda be able to spread it on. I wanna add a scoop of garlic, probably about that much, so about a teaspoon, maybe a little more. I also want to add some Parmesan cheese. Not that much. Definitely want some salt in there. A little bit of pepper. And Italian seasoning that will give you your Italian flavor. I'm going to mix that together. And then the trickiest part about this, which is really not that tricky at all, is garlic powder. That's going to give you your garlic flavor for your garlic bread. You can't have garlic bread without garlic powder. And what I usually do, we'll grab a bread end, you know, the thing that nobody wants to eat. <laughs> and I will add garlic to what I think it should, as much as it should have. So I have added that much, and I mix it up. By the way, if your butter melts all the way, it doesn't really matter, it'll be okay. Just make sure to mix all your seasonings. As long as your seasonings are good, then you're good. So I usually will just take a little piece and dip it a little bit. And that's not got enough garlic. like that and spread it around make sure to get it on there really good don't miss any places and that's what I'm just going to continue to do until it's all done and it was done that was one cube of butter and it covered an entire loaf of French bread full size and I have to tell you guys a little bit of a secret normally I only do this on regular bread just little slices of bread I just line my cookie sheet with normal slices of bread and put this on it but because this is YouTube I'm trying to be all fancy and like perfect for you guys whatever <laughs> so I would just do it with a normal loaf of bread if you have that because whatever you have in the house is what you want to cook with right when you're at home you just want to make something really quick so I would suggest this because it tastes really great and it looks really pretty but normal pieces of bread taste just as good so this is a little bit more brown than I like, but it's still perfectly good. And I just like to chop it up like this for everybody to have. And I just do that throughout the whole thing, and then we have a whole bunch of French bread, and it's so delicious. So, please subscribe to my channel if you like this video, and also comment and tell me things that you want me to try. And then also hit the like button, and we'll see you next time.